Valve selection for a gas pipeline block station. When a gas pipeline is installed, it is divided up using block valve stations. This enables various sections to be isolated for inspection and maintenance. The block valve is typically a full bore, soft seated ball valve to allow for scraping. However, this valve cannot be opened against full differential pressure without damage to the valve seats. Therefore, a bypass is installed around the block valve and used to balance the pipeline pressure prior to opening. Plug valves should be used in the bypass as they are capable of opening and throttling against full differential pressure without damage. The block station opening process starts once the section of isolated pipeline has been inspected, maintained and is ready to return to service. The block valve is closed and isolates at full differential pressure. The requirement of a bypass. Let's see what would happen if the block valve, which is a soft-seated ball valve, was operated against full differential pressure. As it is initially opened, the huge pressure drop across the valve generates high-velocity flow, carrying fine dust, rust or scale particles in close proximity of the valve seats. This results in seat damage and a block valve that cannot seal bubble tight once closed. The bypass valve sequence. To avoid this, a bypass is utilized to balance the pressure either side of the block valve prior to opening it. With the vent valve closed, bypass valve one is opened allowing pressure into the bypass. A plug valve should be used as it can be opened against full differential pressure without seat damage. Now bypass valve two is slowly opened, gradually building pressure in the downstream section until the pressure either side of the block valve is equalized. A plug valve is also used here, capable of throttling the flow without seat damage. With the pressure now equalized, the block valve can be opened safely without the risk of seat damage. The two bypass valves have now done their job and can be closed providing bubble-tight shutoff against the main pipeline. Venting a pipeline section. Block stations are also used to vent sections of the pipeline into the atmosphere. This operation would start with all valves in the closed position. Bypass valve one is then opened, allowing pressure into the bypass station. The vent valve is now slowly opened to release the pipeline pressure. Once again, this is a demanding application opening against full differential pressure. Hence, a plug valve is used to ensure bubble-tight isolation to the atmosphere once closed. 